Good evening, this is Killing String coming at you with a uh, uh, mail call, some big boxes, and a couple of smaller packages. And as a time saver, I went ahead and cut them open. I did not open them up, I just cut them to make it uh, go a little faster. So the first thing that I'm going to remove out of the package is something that uh, I have ordered for my mosque in the past for the bathrooms for uh, extra lighting or emergency lighting when the main lights go off. And these run on AA batteries. This is called a Light Angel and then there are several knockoff versions. And uh, what these have is, uh, I'll peel this sticker off, Don't that. this is a motion sensor and when you put four AA batteries in there, it turns this switch back here to on and what it will do is when the lights go off or you're in a dark space and when this is turned on this sensor will t detect your movement and this light will come on and with a fresh set of batteries in there you get a good amount of light and uh, this can be wall mounted and uh, usually these come with uh, sticky pads Sorry about that. I better. Uh, I'm not going to edit that out. But this one did not. This box was damaged, but that's okay because I'm going to have it mounted with uh, screws so that it doesn't fall off. And uh, I've had issues with these uh, things falling off when I've tried to stick these on uh, tiles, but. I'm going to replace one that was broken simply because the, the sticky pads just did not stick. So that's the only drawback to these, but being able to mount with uh, put screws in, say like in the back of a, of a wooden door or something like that, or if you use drywall with drywall anchors. So that's that's what this is going to be for and uh, these have come in so handy especially if we have a power outage and you can take this out so this just you could take this out and move it around if you needed to if you want to take it down and different positions that is the first thing that came in. These used to be like a, as seen on TV or infomercial product. Walgreens used to sell them. That's why I bought the first one. Then after Walgreens stopped selling them, then uh, I just started buying them online because after the first one that I tested worked really well. So. Uh, I went for more. Now the second smaller package comes one of my comes from one of my uh, favorite sources. And when they package something, they package it. And these, uh, these mailers that they use to uh, wrap them extra, because they're not labeled, they can be reused. So I will reuse these. And then this is, will be the second British 12 hour shingle meal ration. This is the older version. This is not the 2017 or 2018 version with the tan bag. This is the clear bag. 
and it has a ration heater. It's got uh, it's got the spork. So I will be reviewing this very soon. Now the next one, I got two of these big boxes, and they're very light because the content is very light. So I will simply drop one. the same, drop the other, these are two six gallon buckets from uh, Thrive Life, so they came in two separate boxes, like the boxes that they use, you can't, you can't put uh, two buckets in one because they're too long but these buckets are, are like less than seven dollars each on their website and then in this box this is the other Thrive box get rid of this thing and here I have the two gamma lids for the buckets. And then I have what's called the pantry can of the freeze dried Fuji apple slices. And the can has a pop top which I will not open because I bought this for long-term storage. And then I got uh, get rid of that. Two cans of the diced green and red bell peppers freeze-dried. So these are going to my uh, long-term food storage. Each one has 42 servings. This, and let's see, it weighs 25 ounces or 714 grams. That's 25.7 ounces. And then the apples, the seven servings per pantry can, but it weighs 2.96 ounces or just shy of three ounces or 84 grams. So when when some of these things are freeze dried, they are very, very light. And these uh, bigger cans, they don't have a pop top. You have to use a can opener to open it. But I can tell they're finely diced because it sounds like a bunch of rice in there rattling. But these will go into... I'll bend this down just a little bit. These will go into my long-term storage. And the and my cat's checking out their box. Say hello, Mila. Say hello, Mila. <laughs> yeah, she's checking out the boxes. You know how cats are when the new box comes in. Then I will bag a bunch of stuff to put in these buckets. Then after I fill the bucket to as full as I can get it. Then I just write on the side of the bucket what's in it, like the first two white ones. One is labeled rice, one is labeled beans, and then that bucket over there underneath the table, the green bucket, I wrote instant potatoes on the lid. It's, it's just a snap top lid, it's not one of these gammas, but the, so I wrote on the lid. But with these I write on the side of the bucket. 
So I just wanted to show you what I got in uh, snail mail. I'm using my uh, Gorilla Pod knockoff, and so it just takes a little bit of tweaking to get this thing to uh, to stay up. But I just wanted to show you that, and so I've been down with. You know, with the internet for quite for a good share of last month because of some issues with it so I got I got the internet back up today so I got some videos that I, I want to upload I got a couple that I want to edit and put together and uh, get those uploaded so I'll get I'll get that done probably this weekend so I want to thank you for watching and I'm going to put the link to uh, foreignmre.com is where I bought this ration from I'll put the link to their website and their YouTube channel down there so I can go check them out and see what Art and Nina are up to and uh, so I don't know if I bought the last one of their, uh, so this is menu 10 of the old style uh, British single meal or 12 hour ration. I don't know if I bought the last one. This is a vegetarian one, I believe. And this is the only one left of that section on their site was for the single meal ration was this menu 10. So I bought it and I, I want to give this a try. and. Uh, See what else is good from across the pond and of course anything I don't use I save even these bags are good because these are good bags so I will save these so thanks for watching and catch you on the flip side